Dude, you're opening my vlog right now. What do you have to say? Uh, good morning. You can't say this on vlog television. Alright. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Start the car, Ben. We some old flames. Is that this one? That's what was happening. That third back Thursday is gonna be a real killer online. <laughs> Dude, that squad though, hefty. Sum up the Breakfast Club in three words. Pre-breakfast. Uh, breakfast club. Breakfast. <laughs> I thought you were gonna say Margate. <laughs> Make sure they know it's his birthday, okay? Yeah, but I even forgot I got Ma's birthday on vlog here, and Jones left my car door open. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Cooked to perfection for the birthday. Had to, right? Thank you very much. Looks like a vagina. <laughs> <laughs> it's yeah. like layered. <laughs> yeah, that's like that's like the pussy I've ever been involved with. <laughs> Why is she cackling? Very <laughs> good. <laughs> So I am heading over to Ocean City right now. I'm gonna meet this kid named Nick. He hit me up on Instagram direct. I talked about it before. He wants to do a surf contest this summer to raise money for depression awareness and depression. He was formerly depressed in his life. When I was in high school, I dealt with it a little bit. It's just weird how everything works. Like how, you know, the whole thing with Paul, our family friend passing away like the other day, like Paul suffered from depression. It's just weird how this universe just brings everything together and brings everything full circle if you allow it to. If you're open to the signs, someone who says yes to opportunities, to every opportunity that presents itself, you will find yourself being driven and pushed forward in the direction that your life needs to go. That's kind of what's been happening with me lately and I've just been more open to things. I've been saying yes to everything, every opportunity that pops up, because you never know. You never know what's gonna change your life and you never know when you're gonna change someone else's life. So keep it positive and uh, just say yes. Just say yes, three letter word that can change the world. And yes, if you're wondering, I'm drinking hot coffee on my way to go to Starbucks to get a nice coffee. Got a problem? I didn't think so. <laughs> oh, he's in the spot. Yeah. What's up, yeah. love? That's all I'm getting. The boy. Your eighth coffee today? Number three. <laughs> Number three. Mm. Ten, twelve. Number six with it? Number six. Five. High five. I just doubled down on coffees. A little aggressive, but I figured, you know, fuck it. Um, so Nick's cool as fuck, and he has a lot of good ideas for a surf contest. We're aiming for like mid-July, maybe the weekend after July 4th. Probably gonna have it somewhere in Ocean City, like South Ocean City, and we're gonna raise a bunch of money for depression. We just have a lot of things to put into place. We have to figure out the dates, permits, insurance, what organization we wanna donate to, divisions, posters, yeah, blah, 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 on and on, so on and so forth. But it's a good start. I'm glad that he hit me up. I'm honored, so thank you, Nick. Um, fucking stoked that you chose to reach out to me, and uh, it's gonna be good. We're gonna do a good thing. Get as many people as we can involved, and it should be awesome. Thanks, dude. I'm gonna go home and edit this coffee, though. My heart, though. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I just drove by a construction site. I saw this crane holding up a pipe, and I was like, man, that's a big ass pipe. I think they're doing some dredging out here. You know what I'm saying? I just, uh, you know, I wanted to tell you guys that, okay? I just wanted to share that bit of information with y'all. So, just to make sure that we were on the same page. Sometimes we're hanging out with people and I'm like, hey, bro, did you just turn the page? This is what I want to talk about. Because I thought we were just on the same page and now we're not. Because I drove by the construction site and I said to myself, that's a big pot. This is a big pot. Just wanted you guys. Enough. You guys 
want to know. Why are they moving all this sand around when I need this sand for my point breaks? How am I supposed to shred down the line, down the freaking line, pit it off the top, right drop down for the bottom turn if they're dredging all my freaking sand out? And this is my problem here, like, that's a big pipe. So, this freaking sand's gonna fuck me up because that pipe that they're running through the sand through, this is what I had to say. How am I supposed to get sponsored, make my sponsorship tape with such a big pot running through my freaking lineup. You tell me that, ACUA, Department of Corrections, New Jersey, whatever, who the fuck ever's running this stupid pot through my fucking surf break. You fucking tell me that. You tell me. You tell me. That's the freaking problem. Whatever. Call, I'm going to call up Hurley and complain about it. They need to get fucking John Roseman down here, whatever the fuck his name is, with that waves for water shit. Get my fucking dredge pipe out of the fucking, out of my fucking local lineup so I can fucking get sponsored, okay? You want to save, you fucking, you want to save water. You want to pump sand? All in all, at the end of the day, as a big pot. Big pot. What? How's that flannel treating you? Awesome. This is the best. Super flannel. Awesome. All right, what about these surfboards? I'm taking them. Okay, these, Fuck them. What about these? I'm putting them in my car right now. Hyperflex. 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 Just flex. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Moms. Hey, what do you want? Fuck I these. renters coming in a month. Fuck these renters. Yo, Moms, months. let me live here. You can't live here. I'm fucking bored. Come on. <laughs> I fucking hate my room, Mom. What's going on with this? Just give me a house, Mom. <laughs> give me a fucking house. What's going on with this? I'm going to take it to Rhode Island. Bitch. Should we put this in your car? Yeah, in this selfie stick. What goes first? Here, let me get a screenshot of you with that. Yep, selfie stick. <laughs> she doesn't even know how to hold it. What goes first? All of it goes whenever. We're partying. You. In rage, bro. What? It's a boogie board. What do you call it? <laughs> it's not a it's boogie a board. Boogie what is it? It's a fucking beater! Same thing! No. It's a beater board. A boogie board. You're a fucking boogie board. This is the one you're taking? Yeah. Got fins in it. Alright, I'm gonna put that one underneath. Here, take this. I might shred a fucking slab on this thing, Mom. You know? I probably could do it better. You could body surf a Rhode Island slab, Mom. Three inches of water. All rocks. But for the boys. Hey guys, there's no time like the pretzel. Mmm. Jay Bay. Jay Bezel. <laughs> so here's what's going on. This is my life. This right here, this is a nine minute version of that pilot I was working on. It's called a casting demo. Here it is. I got 11 minutes and 37 seconds right now. I gotta cut it down in nine, send it out. Um. Other than that, I have some more information to share with you. No, June, I need your help. Here's what we're gonna do. With the help of Jay Bizzle, because he's such a good reader. Jay. No. Hold on. Mackie Pankrats. Hey dude, I watch the vlogs every day and absolutely love them all. It would be sick to see the other boys vlogging too. Hob, talk, get on it. Your editing skills are prime and that drift track video is hella bomb. Hope everything is going good for you in Jersey too. What's up, Mackie? Mr. Pankrats. Uh, thanks so much for writing. Thank you very much. Gotta give credit where credit's due. Really dope. Hooked that video up. The fucking gun scene and all that shit. Made it amazing. Did some crazy post-production too. Thanks for writing. Thanks for the support. Yeah, yeah that lunch break though. What's going on in here? I don't know, I was just cutting that little nine minute guy for Schlizzer. What are you claiming? I'm claiming fucking birthday old flake! Nah! Nah! What were you claiming? Some brassies. Too much soda. Yeah. <laughs> you can't even like adding that. That's how brain that I am. Bought three rugs in. Tuna? On city bread. I bought three, I, bought, I, I got mint chocolate chip ice cream. What? I bought three rugs at Kmart hmm. and I think I left one there. Give me that, yo. I don't give a fuck. Shit, I'm so dumb. One rug, two rugs. I left one there. Unless I don't think it's in the car. I'm so brain dead. You guys have to get stoked because devil's food cake, donuts, eclairs, chocolate fudge ice cake, powder donuts for Hob, and this motherfucking cake. Look at this motherfucking cake. For this boy's birthday? Got the hookup for real. How do you feel? 
25. Holy shit. It's all over. And the greatest gift of all. Well, yeah. Some smelly rat. Bread and stuff on these ones. Do you even Facebook? I mean, what am I saying right now? Do you even Instagram direct, bro? <clears throat> Cause I might, sometimes. Sometimes when I'm bored, find myself in the inbox. I need this. I right, let's talk about it, guys. Oh, I got two comments. <clears throat> okay. Four new ones. We got some freshies. Justin Blake, 44. It's been almost a year since your patellar tendon surgery, but how's your knee doing? Do you still get pain here and there? How does it look? Also, keep up the good work with Nub TV. What's up, Justin? Thanks for writing. Um, yeah, uh, when I'm surfing and stuff, yeah, I get pain. I get soreness. I get a lot of muscle soreness. But all in all, I've I've made a pretty substantial recovery, especially for the injury that I had. I really can't complain. I worked really hard to get to where I'm at, and I'm back in the water again. And of course, it's going to be weird sometimes, but for the most part, my surgery site's good. It's just muscle soreness. Mike, 11. Just wanted to say your vlogs brighten my day. Been watching Nub before the full burns were even done. Crazy to see how far you guys have come. And Tuck's haircut is sick. Yee! Keep up the good work, 100. What's up, Mike? Thanks so much for writing. Damn, that's a long time. That's like the whole time if you've been watching since before the full burns. Jeez. I appreciate the fuck out of you writing me. I appreciate the fuck out of you watching Nub TV. That's amazing. I'm glad that uh, I appreciate that you watch. Means a lot. And, uh, yeah, dude. Thank you very much. That's dedication right there, so we appreciate that. Got a couple other ones, just kids asking for t-shirts and stuff. So, I'm gonna leave these guys out. But, talk soon. 5.25 p.m. update. The J. Nobody can hang with the Jaybird. The loser catch. The J catch. I'm saying, film Turner, it's his birthday. Look how cute. Molly has her hood on. Turner's reading or sent with June. Molly's she just on two phones. No, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> There's nothing I can do. Bring it to Come on, rock it out. That's where I got it. Got what? My guitar skills. David Bowie? Or me? From you. <laughs> Maybe from David Bowie, not me. Six, seven. What is it? Bottle of the water? Yeah, we do. Okay, what are you doing? I'm, getting, I'm paying for the bill. Are you a miser? How am I a miser? I'm giving him 97 cents so he doesn't have to like break it up like crazy. How is that a miser? Rag life. Me? Thanks, Thank guys. No, it's been a long, long time. How is it good food call on my part? Thank you. Thank you. Perfect. Perfect. Yo, Hunter. Yeah. Hey, Hunter. 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 Hey, Came down on his head. Bang, bang, Maxwell Silverhammer. That she was dead. <laughs> uh, pure gold, pure gold. Never came in the house. So how can it be in the house right now? Dude, this is crazy. You're lying. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, outside, and he never came in the house. He's now in the you're house telling. Right now, walking around with shoes on. I can't even come over. You can't come over. Marshall, <laughs> I needed a warning from Marshall. And Mimi's trying to leave the dog outside. I'd rather leave Mimi outside than the dog. No, that's not. You that is not creep. nice at all, Robert. <laughs> and Marshall. I'm just leaving. Fuck it. You're this not lady's leaving. fucking psychotic. I'm not hanging out here with you're this not, shit. Wait, Straight up. Come on, Marshall, come. Give her a stool. Marshall, come. Maybe Turner's birthday. Well, what the fuck's wrong with that lady? She's calling me a creep. Fuck it. I'm so, out. Oh my gosh, but it's so now it's not worth it that he came over here to be hurt. It's not worth it that he came with the dog now. He just hurt Batman for no reason. You might as well come in and eat. How'd I hurt Batman? He's under the bed. Why do you have to this dog's like? just as relevant in this life as me, Mimi. Not as relevant Ma, as Batman. We you? just had him talk. Coming Everybody back in and you're doing it. That's the problem. No, I'm saying, since Batman, he might as well come too. in now. 
Not really. Batman's the best of all the animals. You're just that, like under her breath, like get me some of this here. You got fucking childish. <laughs> you guys. These squads, dude, that I'm a part of. What do we got here? What is this? Kale? Is this kale? Oh, yeah. Cool. Turner, you didn't know. I can get you guys uh, water. Mimi, sit down. No, no, I got you. Even like a piece of grass is just as relevant as me. Or you. I didn't say irrelevant. First of all, I think our non- is relevant. Not oh, that's true. Are relevant. That's true. Yeah, so yeah. for you to be mad about the dog being in here is dumb. All right, somebody better eat this pizza. I got three pizzas. That's, that's all I'm going to say. Eat pizza. Oh, wow. Rob, go eat pizza. You made a mess over here. We're Stella. deep in the heart of battle right now. <laughs> <laughs> Who will win? Video <laughs> Old school. Video <laughs> summer girl. Old school versus new school. Yeah, sure. Versus the middle yeah, school. Yeah, Who will win? <laughs> Old school versus new school versus the middle school. Who will win? The middle school. Mom. <laughs> new age thrash. Old school passion. That's your middle school rag. <laughs> Who has the upper edge? I know that. Okay, let's so instead of thinking the way that you guys think, you have to solve the problem of today. You have to look at it from a capitalist way. Do a private business. I don't know what I'm missing. Besides a camera and a guitar. Other than that, I don't know what I'm missing. I'm just not into that. Squad. Let's do the uh, birthday thing, right? Getting a cake. Let's get the cake. <laughs> Let them eat cake! Um, hey guys, you know what we should do? Talk politics! Alright, a one, a two, a one, two, three. Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday, dear Tucker! Happy birthday to you. Make a secret wish. Don't tell anyone. Ooh, God, this is even up a little much. You look like a monkey <laughs> and you smell like one too. Yeah, this is a freak show. Guys. I live in a madhouse. <laughs> <laughs> All right, are you gonna should I take it in there for you to cut it? Or do you want to cut it here? What do you want to do? What do you want to do? We could might as well take brain. No, in no. Yeah, just take it in the kitchen. No. Here's your boat. He's allowed up there, Brian. Don't make him scared. Marshall said. <laughs> <laughs> How about a big cut? Check me. Check me. <laughs> what are you doing in there, Jay? Poor girl. What, Poor what? baby. <laughs> Just 
can't be saved But you keep going down, you keep going down Let's get carried away You can kick me in the face If I had a time machine I don't know, work in progress, but uh, sounded pretty good. I think my strings are beat again, dude. Those fucking Florida discount music guys, Wildcats.